Welcome back to my Let's Play for Cookie Mountain Quest, and it's time to slay the dragon. Because what else can be on this final stage? Like, forget the cookie. We know there's a dragon about. That's a far more serious threat. And a far better final boss, after all. Though, oddly enough, if you shoot these um, lemon heads with the um, ultimate weapons, they don't actually respond to it for some reason, which doesn't make much sense to me, but yeah. Blast lemons as much as you want, it doesn't really affect them. Okay. There we go. Yeah, there's quite a few enemies in this area that require you to make use of the shield in order to stay alive. Um, you don't have to. I mean, you can just take the hits if you wanted. I mean, I don't advise it, but it's an option. Oh, yeah. Defended myself from that one. But you can always eat the fries in infinite number of times if you'd rather not um, defend yourself, you know. Just take the hits and then heal afterwards. It's an option. I mean, not the best of options, obviously, but an option. No one says you have to play smart, after all. Well, let's just juggle that lemon head. Get out of my way. Ah. Uh, the fun. Well, eventually we'll kill you. Ah, the dragon's overhead. Well, let's go. Ah, uh, here we go. Ah, uh, Mr. Cookie's here too, huh? Oh, don't call us our your tier anything, seriously. Why are you surprised? You really didn't think those raisins could kill us, right? I mean, we've killed enough of them already, and you were there. You know we've killed plenty of raisins. Well, apparently you're gonna have to let us ruin it because you're about to die. You're not very self-aware, are you? It took you that long to realize there's a dragon behind you. I love the face expression, though. Yeah, we're shooting fireballs that don't even matter. Oh yeah, keep shooting them. Oh, no reason not to keep firing. We'll flip back into it at some point. Oh, yeah. Oh, it summoned the fire, did it? Oh, here, take this. Sword of Destiny saved my life. Well, that was easy. These sewer weapons make this final boss a joke. <laughs> well, I suppose that's sort of the point. They are optional super weapons, after all. A reward for hunting down all those bonus badges. Look, everyone, it's Prince Carl. What are we doing here? We're here to save you from the dragon. Uh, transition into the real world. We've left the realm of fantasy. Though, those eyes are a bit creepy. They look soulless. Like there's an empty, infinite void within them that leads only to madness. <sighs> I guess everyone in this game has them. Yep, an adventure. Coloring looks a bit sloppy on her hair, though. Or is that really just a splotch on the wall? And the blue in the um, window, too. Or the haunted cave, or or the giant ogre. Want to hear more, huh? Well, first we went through a land of cotton candy. Ah, end credits. Here we come. Oh look, the zombies running away. It's actually being smart for a change. Oh no, it's trying to follow us. Nope. It's diverting itself. It's not come for our brains just yet. Hmm. Island quest. Hmm. That may be worth checking out. Or not. Not sure. Well. 
I barely even remember those guys. Oh yeah, they're in that one stage. Or at least two of them were. With the ogre. Who we completely disheartened by being able to find all the solutions. What the? Are we gonna walk right past the lemon head? I was to say it better respond. Otherwise, that'd be ridiculous. Okay. Guess that's basically it. Uh oh. It's a dragon! Look out! Hmm. Any other scenes for us? Ah, uh, just the end screen? Okay, gotcha. Hmm. I suppose that does it for Cookie Mountain Quest. Till next time, then. See ya!